Uh, 67. <laughs> that was the high today. What a day. <laughs> what a day. 56 is the normal. The low this morning was 32. It's cold this morning. Uh, we saw a freeze at DFW. So enjoy it. I want you to. Southwest winds right now. A little breezy at times. It's been 10 to 20 miles an hour, but 67 at DFW currently. We have clear skies across all of North Texas. We have a cold front that gets here late tomorrow. That cold front, it is going to cool us down dramatically uh, for Friday, but that's not the Arctic front. It is going to bring us a chance for thunderstorms, though. Most, as I say, all of Thursday, practically all of Thursday. It's just like today. A lot of sunshine for most of the area. Some clouds east. Watch as we get into the evening. Here comes the cold front. There it is at 7. There it is at 11. So it's going to spark thunderstorms, and it's going to be a pretty sharp cutoff on who sees rain and who doesn't. That cutoff is pretty much split right here across the central portion of North Texas, including through the Metroplex. Dallas, Fort Worth area, some thunderstorms, Collin County, possibly 11 p.m. down through Johnson and Ellis County. That's midnight. Here it is becoming a, a bigger line of thunderstorms. The better severe threat overall, eastern portions of North Texas as the thunderstorms get a little more time to kind of build up here. So that's midnight. Paris down through Corsicana. This is one o'clock in the morning, Clarksville down through Athens and Palestine. That's the leading edge. And that's out of here. It's, it's not lingering a long time. So let's see, 11, 12, one, about three to four hours of an opportunity to see thunderstorms late Thursday into Friday. Cold front clears the area. It's going to get really windy again on Friday. Gusts could be 40, 45 miles an hour. I won't rule out a 50 mile per hour gust either. In the thunderstorms, as those move through, there is that risk for some strong to severe uh, thunderstorms for the Dallas Fort Worth area. It's a level one marginal risk, a level two to the east, slight risk. Eastern portions of North Texas, 60 mile per hour gust, possibly some damaging winds too. Now, beyond that, we've got to talk about the Arctic uh, front that's going to get here late in the weekend and early next week. It's beautiful in Texas right now, miserably cold in Canada, as it always is in January. Uh, temperatures way, way below zero. That Arctic air will displace into the United States. Here's the leading edge of it Friday morning. Here comes the leading edge of that Arctic air. Look, it's kind of sad. We're just sitting here waiting for it to come, but it gets here. Saturday night, the cold front will move through. Sunday looks really cold. Temperatures will fall. By Monday morning, it's going to be brutally cold with temperatures sitting uh, in the single digits and teens. Now, the million dollar question, and this is what everyone wants to know, and we're still, we will fine tune this forecast as we get closer. Will there be snow? Will there be ice? The answer is quite possibly. Late Sunday, we'll see a little disturbance roll through. It may generate a little bit of freezing rain, a little bit of snow. This is midnight Monday, overnight Monday into early Monday morning. A little bit of snow is still possible, a little bit of freezing rain. The highest chance of that right now, eastern portions of North Texas, the Metroplex is not excluded from that chance. We do have a chance of a wintry mix in the forecast for the Dallas Fort Worth area. Keep checking back. We will have the latest forecast for you as we get closer. But right now, plant and, and it could stick around a little while too, because you'll see in the 14 day forecast, it stays below freezing for several days. Tonight, 38 degrees with mostly clear skies. Tomorrow, 70. Storms move in late in the day. It'll be breezy. Take a look. 54 Saturday, there's the Arctic front. Okay, so 38 Sunday, we're down to 13 Monday morning. We only make it to 26 on Monday, down to 12 on Tuesday with a high of 30 Tuesday afternoon. We'll go above freezing sometime late Wednesday morning. We'll go to a high of 48 Wednesday afternoon. And then another Arctic front, not as uh, significant, but still very cold next weekend. Uh, look at that. We'll go down to 38 degrees next Saturday. So winter's here. It was overdue. Uh, yeah. We've had a mild winter so far. I mean, it was almost 70 degrees today and it will be tomorrow. So there you go.